<laughs> I'm asking you a question. You're no, like, no. nah, we ain't even going down that road. That that don't happen in my house. So they don't look at other men. <laughs> nah, they. I really feel like they don't, in a sense, because uh, there's also a righteous element. Like to be honest, man, my women are like them. They're like nuns, man. Like there's a big righteous element to them where I, I don't feel like you know. Um, it's like asking the preacher. It's like asking the preacher. Um, is he jealous with his wife looking at dudes? I don't think that she's really on that. You know what I mean? I don't think it happens. They might find people they think is attractive. I mean, they might find a guy that they think is handsome. And I'm not mad at that because he may be handsome. You know, um, but is she attracted to him? That's the thing. It's, I don't think they find themselves attracted to other men. Okay. I'll leave it there. Oh, uh, it, 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 Within this lifestyle, is there a hierarchy? Meaning, does your first wife... Is she like that? The head chicken charge? How, how does it work with the women? Yeah, well, I would say that um, there definitely has to be a respect on who came first because they've carried this weight of this relationship before whoever's newer, you know. So we do um, like to show respect to whoever was there first. It's not a hierarchy because I believe that everyone's equal, but. Um, there's definitely um, a balance there because there's also people are better at different things. So like if someone's a better cook, they have hierarchy in the kitchen. If someone's a better driver, they have hierarchy in the car. If someone's a better cleaner, they have hierarchy there. Some of, some of my women have uh, speak multiple languages. So we expect her to lead when it comes to speaking that language, you know? So we, you know, we do believe in hierarchy accordingly. But as far as the relationship goes, no, nah, it's, it's equal. You know, I don't see one wife particularly greater than the other. But um, I definitely put some respect on whoever was there first. OK, let's let's stick with the seeing one wife greater than the other. I mean, you're, you're a human being. Um, mm -hmm. Sometimes you just get along with people better than you get along with others. And I get that that all right. of you guys are one. You're, you're in a, a relationship and it works for you guys. But do you find that mm -hmm. you gravitate toward any of your wives more than the others? And is that why things sometimes can get a little tricky with the jealousy? Uh, No, nah, um, I think that's... Um... Like I said, they all have different qualities. So I'll give this example. Like Some of them are more like baby energy some of them are more like uh like a uh, cuddling type and so we cuddle we may cuddle more some of them are more independent you know and they love me but they don't have to particularly be up under me sitting up under me all the you know if we're sitting on the couch or laying up under me but um i still make sure i cuddle with everybody i, sh I still make sure everybody gets love but now nah, i think naturally uh some people just want more of certain things than others want like some people want to cuddle more some people want to um be around me a little closer than others you know and it seems to just all flow out and work i don't really have a problem um on that level they all accept it and understand like you know and well i and, didn't ask it like i, said, I, I didn't ask that question from their perspective i'm asking from your perspective mm -hmm. you 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 okay i, I just wouldn't like we're all human beings do you find like, you know what? I like wife three and four just so much better than I like one, two, and five. Nah, nah, not me. Nah. Um, I like them all because to me, it's kind of like having your best meals that you like. You you may have five, six meals you like, and then they're all different meals. You like them for different reasons, but you love them all. You know, I love them all. I like them all. They all have things I like. Mm-hmm. You know, I try I try not to date. I don't want to date nobody I don't like. If I can't be like obsessed with you or attracted to you, I don't really want to date you. You know, uh, are you done? I think that's how you. I'm that. sorry. Are you done growing your tribe? No, no. you still I'll be done. Growing, I'll be done growing when I start having children because I don't have any children yet. So my thing is I'm going to stop dating new women when I start having children and I'm in that mindset. You know, right now we're still open and we're building the tribe and we're building the credit and we're building our money up and we're building our foundation. At some point, I'm going to say, hey, now we've built so much. I don't want to let nobody in. 
we built so much, it's done. This is who we are. It's no in and outs no more. We're having children. And that's when I'm going to stop dating. Okay, so you have five women at your disposal at any given moment. None of which has gotten pregnant? Nah, pull out king. <laughs> <laughs> pull okay, out. and, and they're all, I mean, out. they're women. I'm sure they want kids. Mm -hmm. They're all cool with being yeah. on your timeline when you decide it's time to have kids? Yeah, yeah, because we also have a vision of how this supposed to play out. So we would like to have acres of land. We like to be in a certain space in life at the time. We like to have our own form. And, you know, none of us want to have children until we're in that particular situation, too. So they're not rushing me at all. My mom's rushing me. Mm -hmm. My mom's asking me for grandkids. <laughs> and at this point, my mom loves them. My mom knows them. And my mom gets it at this point. And she's like, you know, have the kids. Have kids. You ain't getting no younger. The girl's getting older. And she's on me. But we're waiting. You know, we're not rushing. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.